everybody, Gamer Petty here, bringing you a brand new series for our YouTube channel. We are going to be playing through a game called Wildermyth. Now, I'm not sure what to expect with this game. I haven't actually watched any videos or playthroughs or even seen anyone play it. Um, the reason we're playing through this game is because it's been asked of us several times, but mostly by Kyle, who is a longtime supporter of the channel. So Kyle, this one's for you. We're finally here <laughs> playing the game. Um, I'm kind of excited about it because I don't know what to expect. I didn't read too much up on it, so if I'm a huge noob, I apologize. But let's go ahead, get play. Um, ooh, multiplayer, but no, we'll do new story. Oh, dang. Okay. So there's different stories here. Okay. So Age of Ulstrix, a three chapter story that is geared towards new players. Face off against the implacable Gorgon leader Ulstrix. Guess we're gonna have to. Main enemy, Gorgons. Difficulty. Adventure. Standard difficulty. The lands are dangerous but won't punish you too harshly for mistakes. Storyteller. This is probably focus on telling stories with more control over the outcomes. The world is brutal, combat, un combat unforgiving, few survive unscathed. Those who revel in misery. <laughs> yeah, we'll do adventure, yep. Yeah. Carved in stone, on one save file only, every decision is permanent. Man, is this like XCOM? Like Iron Man mode? No retrying after game over. Um... Nah, man, if I, if I, if I, I always choose this and regret it later, so I'm gonna leave that off for now. We've got a seed, it looks like, so we'll just stick with that seed. Let's go to the next. Party select. Um, future warrior, hot-headed romantic, romantic green. Oh. Farmer, 18, 19, 18. Um. Okay. Name and details. Oh, Dane, so you- Oh my god, I could be here for hours. <laughs> um. I wanna make a male. Oh, cool. I wanna make a male. Body type, masculine. Uh, voice. Can I hear that at all? It will do B. He's attracted to women. Allow random. Allow this hero to fall in love with another compatible hero over time. If unchecked, specific events can still cause this hero to form. Okay. Allow random rivalry. Allow children. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. Jeez. Uh. Jimmy, what should we make this one? <laughs> um, we're gonna go Samson Gray. And head. Like that one. Face. Hmm. These are all female, look like. Well, I guess they could be whatever you want them to be, but... Alright, let's do that one. And then... Oh, dang. I mean, okay, uh, Kyle, I'm in love with this game already. <laughs> like, I didn't know you could... Just ma straight up make characters like this. Okay, we're gonna go that one. We'll get some stubble colors. Can, yeah, can I change this? Looks a little sickly there. Um, but can I make it just a little bit dark? There we go, a little more saturated. Uh, hair color. So Samson is a character that I used to role play. He had dark brown hair, so we're gonna go ahead. What is this? Oh, 
Oh, it's Bell. Okay. Um. Let's, can, I, can we give him a red? Like a red belt? Yeah, and then primary color. Yeah. Okay, that's Samson. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright. I'm going just a little bit taller. Okay. So that's Samson. How do we get... Like, change this. Health, speed, recovery rate. Relationships. No relationships. Customize. History. Oh, Samson was a big, smiling brawler of a boy. He grew up adored and deplored in equal measure. Growing to abhor violence as he got older, he studied the words of philosophers who'd sought to rid it from the world. Oh, abhor violence. Okay. The untrampled spaces found protection under his vigilance. Oh, you could just write your own. I'd like to make, um, um... Book, physical, integrity, thorny. I don't want to do thorny. Oh, I can't choose integrity. Destiny and integrity. Physical destiny and integrity. How do you change hot headed romantic? Oh. Full of potential. Farmer. Works the lands for living. Destiny. Something important looms in my future. No, actually, it's pretty simple. Integrity. The joy of motion, the sens sensuationist. <laughs> Being alive. Human. Young. Alive. Okay. Farmer age 18. Okay, I'm, I'm not gonna do that for everyone, I don't think. Hot-headed romantic. Romantic greed wagon. Bookish greed wagon. What changes that? Shay was found in the woods by a monstrous being of bone and gears. Oddly, uh, it didn't hurt the abandoned child, but saw her into the arms of a cobbler and her husband Fupor, before disappearing without explanation or sign. Militia life fit awkwardly on her. She had to... Oh, that's awesome. Okay. Um. Snarky. Poetical, romantic, aloof intellectual. That's a peacemaker. Hot-headed romantic. So we got two hot-headed romantics. <laughs> Abtana Gauntwasp. No, I don't want that to be her name. Customize. I would like her to be... I like Eve. Oh. Eve, uh... Hmm. I'm thinking I'm just stuck in, uh, uh, Eve Loveheart. Okay. Fem yep, female, feminine, attracted to men. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, she's pretty, so we'll just leave her like that. Uh, Lucky Wildheart Flirt. Mm. Wildheart. Okay. And then we're just gonna re-roll this one and get whoever we're the greedy loner. Aloof goofball, aloof leader, snarky hothead, bookish loner. I like her. Snarky greed wagon, fine. Dark heart? No, I don't want Dark Heart. I want uh Proud. <laughs> Not weird either. Uh, loyal, and mysterious is fine. Um, I would like to change her name. Um, you know what, 
know what? That's fine. All right, Samson, a two eighteen-year-olds and a twenty-three-year-old. That's fine. Done. Okay. Um. What is this? Grant starting calamities. Calamities make the game harder. The recommendation is based on the difficulty level in which legacy heroes used to- Oh, okay, okay, okay. Alright, so we've got Samson, Eve, and Galley. Uh, you know what? I gotta change Galley's name. Oh, Ada! I love that name. Ada, uh, Green. Okay. Yeah. Yep, Samson, Eve, Ada. Good. This is our group. Alright, start. Growing the land it takes just a bit of time to put all this together. This book. What do I do? <laughs> uh, character sheets. Okay. Next. Got a deer running there from a. There's room in it for another story. It's cold. I'm stuck here. Anything to prove I lived, I guess. Not that, not that I'm giving up. Sun will come. Maybe my friends. Oh, is Ada stuck? <sighs> but, all right. This is how I'd start it. Here in our yondering country, something in the woods is very strange. Pretty. So it's sun, sunrise. Tugged along by the gentle desire to see friends, a young man named Samson takes the seasonal road to the town of Brightstride. I wonder how many of these soft-glancing town ladies remember me. <laughs> Samson. <laughs> well, I guess I'll just have to do something memorable this time. Breeze is light that day. Birds are timid. In fact, the whole world is taking a breath, ready to leap in the sea. Why are we going into the sea? I'm there already, huh? Here's the hard part, getting Eve out of bed. Hopefully it's just her in there. I hope, and hopefully she's wearing clothes this time or else I, or else, that's smoke? Uh oh. Fluttering flames roost among the far off rooftops. Samson hurries towards town, thinking of Eve, a young woman whom he's known since boyhood. Choose. Watch me worry, and she's fine. So they have a rivalry. Uh, she must have tried to cook breakfast again. A friendship. That woman will have something to do. With some explaining to do if she dies. Romance. Uh, let's do a plus friendship. For now. Eve, you alright? I'll get you out. Just make a little noise. Constructing mission. Uh oh. Okay. Oh. Um, a hero has an action left if it's green. A hero could do a single move, which takes one action, or a double move, which takes both actions. Hero has no more actions if it's yellow. Okay. Um. This is one move. Objectives are listed in the top bar. Oh, put out the fires. Okay, let's go here. Ext oh, extinguish this. Okay, and then we'll go up here. We'll extinguish this one. Open the door. Okay. Uh, open that. Her house is still standing at least. Eve, open up! You have help out here. He doesn't know. Why is no one the door unlocked? Eve shoves it open. Hey, do you not smell the- I smell the smoke. Get inside. Hup. She whack him with a bow. <laughs> Slam. Oh. Yeah, your- your bow. Yeah, there's things in the streets. You didn't see any? Like, monsters? I don't know. I've got one trapped behind- Uh-oh. Behind the house. They just rampaged in all of a sudden? Why not kill it? Right, so here, I've got some tools around. You're stronger than I am. You can swing something pretty good. I bet we can at least drive it off. Uh, I would like to keep this creature at arm's length. If it breaks stones, it'll break bones. <laughs> this is what 
This is for cooking. Why did I grab this? Uh, I'm going to do a pickaxe because I feel like Samson's just up close and personal. I'm sure we can shut it up, whatever it is. Just be ready when you open that door. Faux cards. A row. Hooves thrown sloppily around beneath it. Runs staggering, bellowing its agony. Mmm. Kill the beast. We gotta go out this door. Okay. I'm gonna put Samson here. And, and then here. Eve, you're gonna come up right behind him. And then, do we have an overwatch? <laughs> I feel like I'm playing XCOM. Um, I'm gonna wait. Alright. Um, Samson. Open the door. <gasps> the rose revealed. Reduce damage. Uh, stand adjacently to an ally to wall with them. Walling reduces incoming damage by one and does not stack. Okay. I'm gonna go here. Um, and then... Eve, I'm gonna put you wall in here. Then I'll have you shoot it. Nice. Samson, I'm gonna have you wait. Are you attacking Eve? Stop it, man! Samson? Can we wall right here with her? Yes. And then... Yeah. Victory! Sick. Okay, I love the game already. <laughs> Samson has grown stronger. Warriors like Samson are built, built hardy, enduring with a natural aptitude for battle. They develop powerful techniques for close combat. Samson Gray is now a Greenhorn Warrior. Choose an ability. Vigilant. Samson's height and senses allow him to perform a two react- Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's Overwatch from X- XCOM. Thundering Challenge. Once per combat, as a swift action, Samson frightens the enemy, forcing them to spin- Nah. Gage. As a swift action, Samson gauges a foe, forcing it to attack him. Samson must stay in range and maintain a clear line of sight. Oh, like a- like a taunt, huh? Oh, Vigilance is so good, though, but I do feel like the taunt would be sick. Alright, let's just do Enrage. And Eve is a hunter. Hunters like Eve thrive in the wild, surviving through stealth and peerless archery. They master their surroundings and bring down large quarry. Uh, Ember Arrows. When standing by a blaze, Eve's ranged attacks have zero damage. Plus one shred and start fires. Fires can't spread onto her. Ooh. Fox light. Eve has a plus one speed once per combat as a swift action. Activate the dodge. Or activate to dodge the next two attacks against her. Yeah, let's give her... I, I know I'm going, like, complete defensive right now, but... You found Igneous Knee Pad. No-nonsense knee protection. Alright, let's give that to Sam. Oh my god, and it shows up on his character. This game is amazing. <laughs> Claim it. You're about to get very popular. The creature's death is quiet. It seems to slip from life in a few stunned, hazy blinks. They'll spend a piece of the day getting the flames under control. The damage isn't as bad as it could have been. Townsfolk emerge from hiding to fight fires and clear debris. Some full of curiosity, others visibly haunted by what they've seen. We should go. Ada is alone, which isn't necessarily worrying, but just... Anyway, a promise is a promise. Ada? She's at that ruined tower by now. I am thirsty, and this place is in rough shape. Others can take care of it, but Ada, uh, Ada will be waiting for us. What happened today could be happening everywhere, couldn't it? Something about that tower is just stuck in my mind. It's like when you get apple skin in your teeth. Is it really? Huh? Yeah. Anyways, I just think we said we'd meet her. We should. The tower is in the hills. You've been there? Yeah, once. Actually, looking at the tracks, they come and they go that direction. Samson and Eve follow the pounded path of monstrous feet, hoping for the best and dreading every other possibility choose. Well, they've got a rivalry? A friendship or a romance? You said you'd be fine. Don't make me call you a liar. I'm, I'm gonna... Hmm. 
It'd be interesting, man. Just be breathing, okay? So we can all yell and go home. I'm gonna do rivalry between those two. A wordless, a wordless while passes between them, but the quiet only heightens their worry. I know you don't exactly get along with Ada these days. Hmm? Maybe not. No. You know what it is? It's like today. While we clean up what I'm going to assume was her mess, I bet that coin chaser's up there now. Without a care in the world. Oh, so she's blaming Ada for all that? Find Ada in the tower. Scouting. In order to find sites in the wilderness, heroes must scout the land, which takes time. Click on an unscouted title to show the scout action. So this? Yep. Oh, scout. Uh, how many heroes can we have? This is amazing. I'm gonna send, I'm gonna send Eve. She's a hunter. Ooh. Hit into enemies and her attacks ignore. Yeah, yeah. There's one speed, one per comment. Oh, I'm gonna do this one. Done. Oh, we just take both of them. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, let's go. Tower away where Ada had arranged to meet Sanson and Eve is a place she often used to escape to as a girl. She knows its rooms and floors so well. She could survive being chased through them. <laughs> and now I wait, I suppose. She's coughing. Dust gets deep as rain puddles in here. Alive is alive until that beast breaks through. You're a rare beast. Folks would pay to see you. I'd pay not to. The tower has outlived generations. There's an elden dignity in the stones. They stand for standing, though it seems they guard nothing. But as the old will tell you, precious things go overlooked in a ruin. What lodges amid the bones of failure is often the dream that drove it. That book. Why have I never... What, this one that sticks out like a sore thumb? Wait, easy there. I guess you're wondering why I'm talking to myself, huh, beast? I'm also wondering. Ada bends to pull it loose. Uh-oh. Wilder myth. Title drop. The book's heavier than its slender spine suggests. Look at all, all this. It's full of strange stories. The folklore of folk long forgotten. Circles of the ancients. Is wild nonsense how a woodcutter can read the rings inside old trees to find the exact moment a grove begin calling itself a forest. The Tears of Oak Man. Is a weird rootless tragedy of a man made of oak who stands on a sea cliff and is eaten by termites as he waits for his driftwood love to wash ashore. The flotsam beauty floats forever past the edge of the incoming tide. Papa Brightstride's horn spins the yarn of a father who drank so much and laughed so freely that he grew a beautiful spiral horn. His children were very proud. Ada reaches the last word of the final tall tale. A few blank pages are left. This book. Something in her feels like it's coming loose, but she can't tell exactly what. There's room in it for another story. It's cold. I'm stuck here. But alright, this is how I'd start it. Here, in our yandering country, Ada writes, words are ready. Omens have formed in the fabric of everything, and she's beginning to recognize them now. Some are just misgivings. They've crept through her body like the sourceless aches one wakes with. Others are more substantial. Now they seem lightning plain, a promise of thunder. For in the wild black woods where birds once belled, a hateful silence churns. Ooh, that Cthulhu? <laughs> Pain lights Ada's head. Subsides. 
I made it to morning? She lowers her bleary eyes. Her story lies before her in luminous script. Empty pages have sprouted behind. Why do I feel... powerful? Choose. She pulls the spoon from her pocket. She slides a branch from the rubble. It's sturdy. It has a palm-loving twist. Plus spoon, plus staff. I'm gonna have her be a staff wielder. Well, beast, it's time. I'm getting out of here. Oh, cards. A rager. It charges without seeing. Misshapen tusks swinging wildly. Where is it? Where's the door? Where's that the cabinet? Where am I having a problem? Aha! There it is. Uh, interfuse with an object, then use the object to attack. Use the interfuse ability to connect with fire or scenery. Hmm. Okay. Can we, uh, interfuse with this? Candle? And then go back up here. Am I dude? And then, uh, steal fire. And this. How, what, how, click to move. Oh. Can I not steal the fire? What's he doing back there? Steal fire. Oh! It's a, it's an attack actually. Okay. Interfuse Blaze. What are you doing? He's just walking around back there. How do you- he bur it burnt out. Alright. Can I just attack the wall? <laughs> I, I don't know how to get back to him. Interfuse Torches. Oh, illuminate. Stop interfusing with targets. Allows you to interfuse with new target. Steal fire. Ada Green. Ooh. Damage myself. <laughs> Victory. How do I set myself on fire like that? Agrian is now a Greenhorn Mystic, okay? As a mystic, Ada has acquired the knacks for interfusing her spirit with earthly mad- or earthly things, drawing on these bonds to enact formidable magics. Arches. Ada bonds with the earth and summons form seedlings and silt, a wondrous tree that pins surrounding it. Ooh. Ada can interfuse with one additional target. Passive. Does not burn out while interfused. Ooh. Winter salvo liquid upgrade infernal rain. She can be a element. Ah. I like her. I'm gonna do this one. Arches. Salvage plus one heartwood. You don't need this. You can break it down for plus one heartwood instead. Oh no 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 no! Reconsider. I thought it was a ring of cunning. Yes. More monsters roam the ruined halls and rattle the rotting furniture. But Ada moves quietly, sensing her way in the dark. Daylight lands on her wrist. Cool wind soothes her tired eyes. All I had to do was the impossible. Not too bad. She closes the tower door, gentle to make no noise. That was the mystic's art that I did. Right, tower? Where'd I get it from? Could it have just happened? Is it just one of those things? 
things a woman's born with that might blossom in her life when she needs them. Well, I might not deserve it, but you never turn down a turkey, so they say. Who says that? <laughs> Ada! But am I a bedtime story now? Am I going to find a talking animal who gives me a quest? Ada, you bunkhead! <laughs> See if... Hey! Ada, something happened? Hmm? Samson? Yes, sorry. Eve's voice just bounces off my ears sometimes. Samson and I only barely made it. Yeah, see that smoke on the horizon? That's from the town. Yeah, that's Brightstride. It burned? <sighs> Things are different than they were. Hmm. Yeah, well, I don't know if you've ever seen something quite like this. A monster? Sure we have. We slay monsters. <laughs> okay, well, I do magic. Salt Vile Stone. Okay. Sites. You've discovered a new site. It's still under enemy control, though. Click on the banner to assault it. Wait, so she, um... How do we heal her? Let's go! I feel like I do be lawn in the front. And I'm sure no one will mind the view. Samson. A perfect understanding isn't, isn't likely to emerge. What these beasts are, where they came from, what drove them to attack the town of Brightstride. But letting them nest here feels like the wrong idea. What? I'm not wrong, am I? Anyway, a plan. Do we have one? Back in my house, it was pretty simple. Kill the beast before Q. Came out of there. If we're methodical. So Eve wants to... Courage? We're methodical, patient, we can fend them off at least. No, let's go get them, man. Courage. All heroes plus two damage potency for three turns. Nice. We've got a raccoon. What kind of raccoon? And a row. Every hero starts out with two action points every turn. Different abilities have different costs. Single action, single action. A single action and ends turn, a single action, a swift action. Free once per turn. So this ends turn, that ends turn, this is free. That's one. Alright, Samson, um... What is this? And wait for the enemy to come within range. Hit up to one enemy in melee attack. Alright, you're gonna go here, and you're gonna guardian. Eve, you're gonna go here, and Ada, you're gonna go here, so you guys are kind of protecting each other. Um, I'm gonna have you interfuse with the torches, so you can illuminate them. And you shoot that guy. Get him, Samson! Dodged! What the heck? Ow, man! x -commed. Ow! <laughs> okay, um... Nah, Sam, let's have you... Strike this guy. Yeah, why couldn't you do that the first time? You shoot that guy. Took cover? Some scenery grants cover. Ah, uh, I see. Okay, uh, then you're gonna move up right next to Sam. I'd like you to arch. Pin that guy down. Oh, what the heck? Okay, we're gonna risk it for the biscuit here. Oh my god. Blank an enemy? Nah, Sam. Go up and flank him. Strike him! Okay. Dang, our party is, uh, not doing very well. <laughs> Nice. 
Belt of Courage, plus five block. Yeah, hey. Uh, the last misshapen creature folds its bones and dies. Blue fluids darken the dust. So calm accepting death, not natural at all. Natural if you're suffering. Hey, look at us. Look what we did. Yeah. Day drops, day rises. Dusk is sweet. The sunrise sweeter. It's not long before they've cleaned the old tower up a bit. I wish we'd get a storm. How dramatic this place would look. I always knew this morning would rise when I'd gaze into the sky and see a destiny for myself. A destiny to inspire song. Let's not wait to be overrun. We're a company of heroes now. We'll walk the land, we'll fight. People need us. We'll give ourselves a name and make sure it's one they'll sing. Sound like you've thought about this. Name the company. We'll be called Wara's Net. Well, how about the Empire of Evergreen Light? Maybe the Battalion of Era. <laughs> All this stuff, man. Uh. Aura's Net. Empire of Evergreen Light. The Battalion of Era. Enter your own name. Let's call ourselves. Uh. <laughs> Um, warriors of, wait, no, 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 uh, dang, man, random, the brethren of East, rebels of the blooming dream, minnows of music, writers of the great arm, hmm, Keepers of the Flame. I like that one. After that, the three of them were inseparable. Rumors are rampant. Heroes are needed. This world will be flooded in sorrows, but its defenders are joined by a fire that night. Here follow the tales of the Keepers of the Flame. Be remembered. Calamities. Your enemies improve their strategies after every fight. Uh-oh. New card is added to the Gorgon deck. The deck is more dangerous now. Like Gorgon? Oh, deepest Droven Gor Hmm. Not present in this game. Okay. Finish. Uh oh. So now I have Rager one. Okay. Get legacy points by taking new sites. You can spend legacy points to do the following things. Recruit heroes, build new stations, cancel calamities. Mm. Once a site is free of enemy control, you can spend some time to secure it. Secured sites provide resources now and at the end of each chapter, which you can use to craft gear at a town or between chapters. Neat. Um... We'll secure this site then. I just don't like lingering here, all right? These places age you. Secure Vilestone. The site can provide resources now at the end of the chapter. Spend resources to upgrade hero weapons and armor. Choose. Investigate thoroughly. Catalog everything. Find an item. Burn what's not useful. Get it ship shape. Work faster. Oh, well, let's find an item, man. Yeah. Done. Yes, please heal yourselves. Oh, is this when another calamity comes? Uh, <coughs> excuse me. A thorough delving through the mysteries of Vilestone has proven rewarding. Since I found something, doesn't it seem like it should go to me? Vilestone will return to the hands of the common folk while they tend it. The site will provide resources at the end of each chapter. Okay. Eyes and gets spell threats. Ooh. Plus five armor. First dash. Uh I'm gonna give it to E. Actually I'm gonna give it to Samson, because he's like 
up front, basically. Oh, he's got it around his waist. That's so cool that it shows up on the characters. Okay. Um. Next calamity. Oh, yeah, yeah. Recruit opportunity. Legacy cost. How much, uh. Oh, LP plus five. Legs cannot be accessed. Clear all hostile sites. Scout Warfin's Gloom. Do what? Need to clear the land first. Oh. So we just gotta go over that way. We can't pass through here. Okay. Should I recruit someone? <laughs> Let's go back here. Sure. Recruit. Let's go. New recruit. Snarky goofball. But we can randomize them. Bearer. Husband. Who looks cool? Hothead. Let's do him. He's cool. Recruit. Trawling the streets again, looking to bring another fresh soul into the fray? Come on, how are we going to become world renowned if we're not growing the ranks? Plus, I would like someone else to talk to you while you and Eve are making up new verses to old Bella's hatchet. The stars were beginning to come out by the time they got back into Bright Stride proper. Good thing we got in when we did. Looks like most people are still out and about. Maybe we can knock on this errand, knock out this errand sooner rather than later. Wait, you're back already? You wiped them out that quickly, or you didn't give up, did you? What? Of course not. Good. That would have been distressing news. Actually, we're back because we're looking to expand the company. What about you? You look honorable. And you could probably fight with that thing in a pinch, right? Oh, he's got a pickaxe, just like Sam's. Probably. A rocky question with a potential gem of an answer. And there's not a lot else keeping me here right now. It's a season when a young man has to figure out what to make of his life. And this season has brought a lot of changes. Can't argue with you there. It would be good to have the help. We've learned a bit out in the wild so far. We can have someone get you up to speed. Hmm. Man, I think two hunters, a warrior, and a mage, maybe? Because then we can do range stuff. Yeah. Alright. Wait, where'd he go? Where's my- where's my guy? Where'd my guy go? I'll prepare a recruit. Done. Infested tiles are unsafe. Infestations uh, increase the strength of the source threat and can ambush groups of two or one heroes and over time will spread and turn into an incursion. You can clear infestations by taking out the source or by sending a group of heroes to patrol on the tile. Oh, it's busted here. Okay. Go. Done. Denkin is ready for adventure. Denkin has coated his weapon with quelling moss. Uh, his physical attack supply a poison as an action. He can toss a flask of burning moss that applies poison to units in the area. Yes, please. Okay. 
cool. Well, I think with that, we're going to go ahead and end this episode here. Um, I really am into this game. This is so much fun. Uh, I think Kyle, again, thank you for suggesting that and everyone else who uh, kind of backed that up. Uh, yeah, we will keep playing this. Let me make sure we can save. Yes. New save. Okay. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and end the episode here, and when we continue, um... We'll probably head over here. Ah, uh, I might take this out. I don't know. Uh, we'll take a look. Uh, but guys, I want to thank you so much for all of your support on this series. If you do want to see more of the Wilder Myth Let's Play, make sure to leave a like or subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, I will see you guys next time. Alright, bye-bye everyone.